Hey guys, Bob and here. And goldfish. And today it's time for math on the path. You already know how to take a number and turn it into a code. But now we're gonna teach you how to work backwards and turn a code into a number. We've learned how to make a base two machine. We put in a bunch of dots and then do a bunch of explosions and we end up with a special code. But what if we have a code and we want to get back to the number of dots we put into the machine? That's what we're going to talk about in this video. Hey guys, I'm going to show you another example. So here, we have our nine rocks. Remember, two on the right goes to one on the left. So let's get started. Okay, now we have to stop from that box because there's only one left so we can't do the roll again. But now there's more in this box, so let's try to work on it here. Okay, all done, but there's still two more in here, so we can do our rule one more time. There, now we have our code for nine. One, zero, zero, one. But what if we forgot how many dots we started with? We can use the code to figure out what our original number was. Let's put some dots above the boxes. One, two, four, and eight. Notice that as we move to the left, each box has twice as many dots as the box before it. We're going to add up the dots from all the boxes with the stone in them. So, since there's one in the eight box, we have eight, and there's one in the one box, we have one. And one plus eight is nine, which is the amount of dots we started with. Suddenly, squalls! Come here, come here, come here! Come here, guys! Is it like so cute! Now, let's try another example. We'll start with four dots. So, let's just convert it to its code form. So, two on the right goes to one on the left. Okay, all done. So the code for four is one, zero, zero. Let's put the dots above the boxes again. One, two, four, and eight. Because we have one dot in the four box, that means we have four, which is the number that we started with. This time we'll put seven dots and we'll work them to the left to get our code. So the code for seven is one, one, one. Let's work backwards. We have a one and a two. That adds up to three. We also have a four. If we add that to the three, we get a total of seven. That's the number we started with. All right, so that's all we have time for today. And as always, remember to try this at home. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. No, a wolf moth sponsor. Are you tired of trying to light all your parents' birthday candles? If so, then you need, need the brand new Base 2 birthday candles. Here we have a 32, a 16, a 2, and a 1. That adds up to 51. Happy birthday, Dad. New Base 2 birthday candles. Your parents will thank you because they're easy to blow out. Now you can get away from fire and get back to family. Morning. Your parents might ask you why some of the candles aren't lit.